Our Tantoxin Hospital is tapping new technology to make healthcare more efficient. Devices at their smart ward aim to address challenges faced by the healthcare sector. Well, these include an aging population and a tight workforce. Sherlock tells us more. This device looks like something out of a spy movie, but its use is more down to earth. Nurses and doctors are using it to contact each other quickly without even touching their phones. Traditionally, we have to pick up a phone call, find the contact number of the doctors, and then after which, you know, you dial and then connect to the doctors and wait for the doctors to arrive to, on site to the ward. So with this DNA device, right, we can call them anytime, anywhere. Decisions can be made uh, almost immediate. So doctors will be able to see um, the situations that the nurses are seeing uh, so that treatment can be, in, uh, treatment can be uh, implemented. La. So time, time is uh, safe. It's one of 20 innovations that have been tested at Tan Tok Seng Hospital's smart ward since 2022. Here, bedbound patients can be turned with just the push of a button. A patient monitoring system will also inform nurses should one try to leave their bed. It has reduced the rate of falls by 34% and saved 67% of manpower hours compared to the previous tracking system of using a mat. This patient monitoring system is currently installed in all single bed and isolation wards in this hospital, but they're trying to make it work in a six bed ward too. When the trial begins at the end of this year, they'll have to find a way to make it detect only the patient is supposed to monitor. The development of new technology in healthcare could be slowed by tight regulations, limited resources and competing stakeholder priorities. That means it could take years before an innovation is introduced in other wards too. But the TTSH team has a workaround. We have been uh, given the, the, the autonomy to actually be the ones screening through the projects and deciding on which ones we need to try out uh, instead of having uh, you know, to go through the old way of uh, going through many administrative uh, processes. So actually we are the ones uh, as a team uh, with the shed. I mean we have all the sh same uh, shed goal in mind to improve patient care. So uh, we are the ones actually deciding and, and uh, uh, accepting the trials and this has actually made the processes much faster. The hospital will scale 14 initiatives to other wards and rapid test another 20 within the next two years.